Hey guys, this is Black Dragon IV, and I'm here with the Bucket Mod Loader MP server installation. Boy, that's a mouthful for smart moving. So, we got to start off by downloading the mods we need. So, the first thing you'll need is the actual mod smart moving. So, version 6.2, you got Media Fire, Dropbox. If you're from the future, that number is going to be higher. The next thing you'll need is the player API for Bucket. And you just hop on over to here and you grab your bucket. Now keep in mind this is for craft bucket 1.0.1-R1. Make sure you get the right craft bucket. If you don't, I don't know what happens. I haven't strayed away from this. Now with a little bit of looking around, I was able to find a compatible mod loader MP for craft bucket 1.0.1. And... I'll put the link in the description. You simply download it right here, this guy right here, and it functions perfectly fine. So once you have all three of these mods, you just need to install them. So hopping over to our server and our mods, we start off with the server here, and this is a vanilla bucket server just run once. Uh oh. Apparently I ran it again. Now it's been run twice. <laughs> I'll just let this quickly start up and then stop it. It's so here I can actually install stuff. Alrighty. So the first thing we're obviously going to need is the mod loader MP. And this is for 1.0.1 R1 hyphen R5, which is the exact um file that you guys were looking at. So you simply you drag drop all these files into your graft bucket dot jar. I'm simply gonna open it up with Rinrar. If you don't know how to do that, then check out another installation video. So, you do not delete the meta.inf, this will actually put in a new stuff into the meta.inf. So you just hit OK, you copy those stuff in, huzzah. Now you want the player API for bucket, this guy right here, it's really long name, crap bucket 1.0.1 R1, hyphen, player API for bucket 1.0. So it's, uh, it's definitely a mouthful. So you just need the .net, and that's that. And last but not least, uh, I have my smart moving right here. I unpacked all the files. So you need your smart moving server for bucket mod loader MP. So all you simply do, put the .NET in there, or that net, uh, net folder, and you let that finish, and that should be it. So let's see this baby in action. Uh, first thing I want to do is actually launch my Minecraft, so I'll be able to join it. And minimize that. And start the server, I suppose. Okay, let's put this in the top left. Okay, start the server. Almost done. Alrighty, server is running. Minecraft is responding now. And here's my server. So if I join the server, I should be able to enter it. And I'm in. That is awesome sauce. So that is the installation for uh, Smart Moving for Bucket. So yeah, just going to wait for this to load a little bit more so I can prove that the mod is fully functional. As you can see, it does give me the warning message of the difficulty. I'm just going to OP myself here really quick. Now I'm OP so I can destroy stuff near the spawn. And as you guys can see, I can climb and I can fit into these little gaps. So that is smart moving for bucket. So thanks for watching guys. Just remember that numbers do change. The versions go up. Always make sure that you're grabbing up to date things. If something isn't compatible I'm going to show you guys this right here to make sure that you do grab all the compatible things. I'm simply going to jump into Minecraft stuff, mods, smart moving. Now inside the smart moving there is a readme.txt underscore server. This gives you all the information on your server. If you keep scrolling down you do get bucket mod loader MP information. Now some of these links are out of date but they will be updated very shortly. Just, you need things like this. You will need Mod Loader MP Release 4, and it tells you, not lower, not higher. So, just remember, guys, if you're ever installing this, please refer to this file. Always refer to this file to make sure that the mods you're grabbing, 
or the uh, requirements you're grabbing are 100% compatible. With that being said, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoy playing on a server with your friends. And don't forget that you do need to join to join a server. You do need to be installed a mod loader MP client install. So thanks for watching guys. And I hope you guys enjoy this mod as much as I do.